I say praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Come on. You know, I just thank God. Hallelujah. What God is doing tonight. Praise the Lord. Um, I thank God how God can move. And, and you don't know when he's moving, but he's moving. Amen. You know, I, this morning, he kind of got me up early and he gave me the 37th Psalm. He told me not to fret. Amen. And I see why he told me not to fret. I had a day to day. I mean a day. But I thank God I made it. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, when Sister Ann and I said they got this flow, and I thought about the song Victory, I have it. So I'm going to go with the flow when they got it. But I'm going to say this. She said it's, it's a worship. Amen. Yeah. I ain't going to start no music, but I got to do this. Hey! Yeah. All right. All right. I'm going to keep the flow, but I got to say, hey! Hey. Come on, come See, on. Hey. Come on, hey. Oh, come on. Hey. Come on now. I know, baby, I'm sorry I scared you, but I had to holler a little bit. Yeah. Came out because I got to get mine out. Yes. Come on now. I, I got to get it out. Yeah. 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 Hallelujah. See, she said the first and floor. But God know me by praise. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Hallelujah. Yeah. Thank you, the leather word of mark and my meditation of this heart. Yeah. Yeah. Be accepted. Yeah. Oh, Hallelujah. In his sight. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Yeah. I want to talk about the threshing floor. As I was looking at each and everybody laying down, crying out to God, and I began to see how you were covering yourselves up. I want y'all to see something tonight. Amen. About the threshing floor. You know, I looked at Wayne about him, you know, she was talking about the threshing. And I was looking at it. She didn't break it down like it should have been broke down. I found out the first and floor, it ain't you laying down. That's going to the cemetery. Oh. <laughs> That's where the first and floor is. You go to the cemetery. Amen. And I got word about it. Amen. I learned hallelujah. When you go to the cemetery, you bury stuff. Yeah. That's right. That's Amen. Yeah. So I'm going to show you in the word. Amen. I don't know how much y'all bury tonight. I tell you one thing. When you bury it, ain't coming back up. All right. All the way, you can't dig it up. I'm going to tell you, because when you dig it up, it ain't never dirt. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Now. I'm going to show you. Let's go to Genesis 50. Praise God. Woo, glory to God. Amen. Tell him he can bring the baby back in now. <laughs> <laughs> it's not by my voice. I got a voice of a trumpet. I, I, I go in, I cut, I holler, I bump. I'm like a bulldog, I bite in. Amen. Amen. <laughs> I went to Wichita and they told me I'm a woman with such a loud voice. I got a voice. God gave me this voice. Because if you come against me, baby, I... Yeah. <laughs> I want you to see something. Last year, I went to 50 and verse 10. Hallelujah. Praise God. Chapter verse 50, verse, start at verse 10. It's the uh, hold them and never use a lie. Come on. I need to go up to the fourth verse down to 12. Amen. I'm going to show you something. And when the days of his mourning were past, Joseph spake unto the house of Pharaoh, saying, If now I have found grace in your eyes, speak, I pray you, in the ears of Pharaoh, saying, 
My father made me swear, saying, Lo, I die in my grave, which I have digged for me in the land of Canaan. There shall thou bury me. Now therefore let me go up, I pray thee, and bury my father, and I will come again. See, Joshua fought father and said, Joe's father has already got his arrangement. Go. When you came in here in this shed, you already got your arrangement. Amen. All right. All right. All right, come on. And Pharaoh said, Go up and bury thy father according as he had made thee swear. Mm -hmm. And Joseph went up to bury his father, and with him went up all the servants of Pharaoh. All the servants of Pharaoh went with him. All right. Come on. <laughs> I'm going to show you something. Sometimes your enemy will go up with you. Amen. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Come on. All right. The elders of his house and all the elders of the land of Egypt mm -hmm. and all the house of Joseph and his brethren and his father's house only their little ones and their flocks and their herds they left in the land of Goshen. Mm -hmm. And there went up with him both chariots and horsemen, and it was a very great company. And they came to the threshing floor. They, that's why we, they mm -hmm. came to the threshing floor. They came to the cemetery. Yes. Oh, yeah. All right. <laughs> 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 They all gathered at the cemetery. The threshing floor is the cemetery. That's what y'all did tonight. Y'all all went to the cemetery. Amen. Hallelujah. Right now. Yeah. Amen. Come on. Okay, what happened? And they came to the threshing floor of Atad, which is beyond Jordan. And there they mourned with a great and very sore lamentation. They was really grieving. Y'all all came together tonight to all grieve. Y'all all holly. All, all different type of holly. Oh. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, y'all were hiding and grieving. Now, some of them were grieving about the children. Some were grieving about the husband. Some were grieving about the mother. Some were grieving about the job. But y'all were all grieving. So y'all was on one mind. One and one. Thank you. All right. All right. Y'all making sense? Yeah. Huh? He showed me. All right, I'm going to show you. Now, I'm going to show you something. Let's go to Job 2. My God, I'm going to show you something. Oh, my God, my God. Job 2. I didn't now, y'all know Job 2. I want 11 through 13. This is Job. Now, it, I'm going to show you the symbolic. How God does a thing. Now, Job wasn't dead, naturally dead, but he was dead in his situation, his sickness. Mm -hmm. He had all to the point that he felt like he was. Right? Dead. Some of us feel like we are what? Dead. Some of us don't have no more. Oh, right. Right. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> so you came to come alive. Amen. And I'm going to show you. Now watch, watch, watch this. Uh, Joel, start at verse 2 and verse 11. Now when Job's three friends heard of all this evil that was come upon him. His friend heard. <laughs> come on, let's see what happened. They came every one from his own place. Mm -hmm. Eliphaz, the Telamite, and Bildad, the Shuhite, and Zophar, the Nehemiahite, for they had made an appointment together to come to mourn with him so, and to comfort him. <laughs> so we all came in to do what? Mourn together. 
Uh-huh. Come on. That's what we came here for. All right. Yeah. We heard about it. And when they lifted up their eyes afar off uh -huh. and knew him not, they lifted up their voice and wept. And they rent every one his mantle and sprinkled dust upon their heads toward heaven. Start right there. Just look at the symbol. When they saw Job in the condition he was, he wasn't looking like he's supposed to be looking. So what they did, they they got on one mind, one accord, his friend, and they ripped their coat. Look at the symbol. When they ripped their coat, they came before him naked. naked. Mm -hmm. And when they came before him naked, Simba, what they do? They grabbed the dirt. Yes. The sin body of the grave. Amen. Yeah. Right. Come on. Mm. <laughs> Come on. Oh, Come on. All right. This is me now. I ain't going out. I, this is this how I preach. Yeah. I'm just a radical person. I, I try to obey what she said, but that ain't in me. <laughs> So they sat down with him upon the ground seven days and seven nights, uh -huh. and none spake a word uh -huh. unto him, for they saw that his grief was very great. So the grief of what? Great. Very great. <laughs> so the night nobody said nothing, because mm. your grief was very great. Come on. That's right. Come on, I'm grieving bad, baby. I ain't got time to talk about nobody. Right. Right. I didn't come here to look at nobody. I didn't come to see what you were saying. I didn't come here to look at you, roll your eyes. I came because my grief was yeah. 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 Me. I came for myself. Amen. God, come on, y'all. Y'all see what the Lord trying to show us? Amen. You don't come to church to look at nobody else hollering. You know they used to tell us down home, don't sit too much around the altar talking to your nephew talking to folks don't be praying. Amen. Uh, Amen. But tonight I wasn't listening to nobody. Amen. I'm going for mine. Because my grieving was great. Woo. Woo! My God! Yeah, I, 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 I'm going to show you something else. Turn right on back to hey, Job. This is Job now. Turn over to 1 and look at verse 5. I'm going to show you something. Lord, I don't want to mess up the person. <laughs> my God! <laughs> look at verse 1 and 5. Still Job. And it was so, when the days of their feasting were gone about, that Job sent and sanctified them, and rose up early in the morning, and offered burnt offerings, according to the number of them all. For Job said, It may be that my sons have sinned, and cursed God in their hearts. Thus did Job continually. Now, that mean, when she said today, when you bury something, you bury it. What Job messed around and did, I'm going to show you something like, don't get Job's spirit. <laughs> Job comes continue with the same sacrifice. <laughs> Give it to the God. <laughs> to the point that it comes so natural to him it, it, that God said, I don't, it wasn't no more time for him to keep offering the same thing to God because he was continue saying, he was continue saying the same thing. So in his own way, Joe was an alright man, but Joe didn't really believe. Yeah. Alright. Oh, Lord. Mm, come on. He didn't believe. So Joe had what? No faith. He didn't have faith at that time. He thought that if I keep offering up, they, they, they mess up, I, I don't cover that. That's right. Mm. But when he did it one time, it's already what? 
Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You don't bear it? Don't you get up in there, oh Lord. If your heart ain't been crazy, he already said. Because he got to go through the process. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Amen. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. <laughs> he got to go through the process of dying. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on now. <laughs> Yeah. So don't look at him because he acting crazy. He just died. Right, man. <laughs> you done buried him. He died for him to come up live. Yeah. 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 In the spirit. Yeah. Wow. Come on. That's it. Get out the grave, y'all. Where's that green seat? What y'all messed up at? Mm -hmm. <laughs> God heard him from the beginning. Amen. But he continued saying the same thing. Mm -hmm. Some of us are still saying the same thing. <laughs> so you continue saying it. So what thing is that? He came what? <laughs> he walked. I hear you. Come on in. Huh? Huh? <laughs> What you say? <laughs> so God told Satan, say, go after him. Mm -hmm. Say, but don't you touch his soul. Mm -hmm. So if you believe what you said on the third floor, you better stop talking. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. you can try on that third floor. Yes, you right. sure will. Mm -hmm. You better bury that snake bear. Yeah. Yeah. Jesus didn't die but one time on the cross. Mm -hmm. All right. And when he rose again, he rose one time. Yes. Mm -hmm. How come we keep dying? Right. <laughs> 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 I'm going to leave that up. I'm going to leave that up. I'm going to keep dying. I'm going to keep dying. <laughs> I ain't gonna keep dying. Amen. I ain't gonna keep going to that same uh -huh. cemetery. Right. Yeah. Right. I'm busy. Thank you. Amen. Amen. Oh, Father, Father, Father. <laughs> we so and so continue doing something. When we come in here, some folks get in the prayer line. The pastor know what you're asking. Amen. <laughs> He just standing there, just hold his hand. You always said that he just standing there. <laughs> just hold his hand, Dad. Y'all feel all right? Y'all think he done said a hundred words? He ain't saying that. He ain't saying that. Cause he continue saying the same thing. Yeah. Come on, man. I'm making it plain. Joe kept continue all of them stinking sacrifices to God. And God took the freshman and said, I receive it and I'm going to take it. I'm going to do what you say. Yeah. What you need to do instead of keep continuing to say, just tell him thank you. The day I tell you, I went through a whole lot. I went to work, and, and he got a whole lot of cats. <laughs> and I went to see Daddy, and the cat came up there. And he peed on the couch. Ooh. I got yeah. fighting. <laughs> That's like that. And I was thankful. <laughs> oh Lord. <laughs> the Lord told me you gonna be frustrated. He said, Don't fret. No. I stood up, I was spent. I said, boy, I can't go nowhere like this. Jesus. Yes, he did. I'm telling the truth. Amen. Woo! Ben peeked me. He said, what you got? I got home. I got home. I went to put in cold rocks and him. Everything. Everything in the war. <laughs> I ain't gonna continue stinking. Amen. 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 Woo. Oh. I said, Lord, thank you. You let me know. Hey, girl, I got frustrated. <laughs> that that ain't all that happened. Then in that time, when I try to get my lesson for the night, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you something when you got to watch yourself. Amen. And God tell you something. And you, he go to sleep. I had gave me a pain pill. He go to sleep early in the morning. 
and sleep three or four hours. This time the man stayed woke. He said, just come. I said, oh, Jesus. I'm trying to get this message together. Yeah. Frustrating. Yeah. Frustration was after me today. Yeah. Yeah. And all I can do is took everything out of life. Everything got on my nerves. Yeah. 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 Come on. Yeah, Jesus. <laughs> but I had to get in the place. I got the press then. Yeah. 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 Got all home. I had to run here and there. Ain't bad. I didn't have all my messes together. I didn't have my stuff together. Oh, my God. I never had nothing off to do. Trying to get this mess together by you getting at the cemetery. <laughs> 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 To get you at the cemetery. <laughs> to realize who you coming up into the altar, you at the cemetery. Yeah, Don't yeah, you get yeah. up and tear that stuff back down. Uh -huh. Let me tell you something. Every time you nail it to the cross, you go back and take it off the cross. Yeah. But if you bury yeah. that sucker, yeah. 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 Come on Come on. Amen. Come on. Y'all see you continue this mess, did See, so God said, no, don't keep continuing talking to me about some stuff. Yeah. I see you go up there, shot and buck and jump and haul up. One and yeah. down. <laughs> <Love Yeah. him>. <laughs> <laughs> uh, come on. After serving, you still. Come on here. Oh, come on here. Put you off a motion. You didn't marry. No. Oh. Come on. Oh. I'm still talking about Job. I, I, I tell we some more preachers got to come up. I'm not going to, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you now. Job was continuing saying something to God. Mm -hmm. And after all this thing happened, instead of him thanking him, look what Job, Job was still complaining. Mm -hmm. Job went to complain. He began to talk to God, tell God this. Amen. And he had the wrong mental attitude. Mm -hmm. Yeah, His did. attitude was funky. Amen. <laughs> yeah. We get funky when God don't do what right, He said. Right, he right. wants you to be funky so He can get the the funk out right. you. Amen. <laughs> 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 Let's turn to Job 3. I'm going to let her read by 3. I'm going to let you read. Okay, I want you to read the 10, but I want you to jump on the last 2. Y'all can read the rest of it later on, okay? I'm gonna, I want y'all to hear what Job's saying. The first 10 were Job, their mama, and he grumbled. He, they say he cursed his birthright. That's what they say, they. But you know what? He actually cursed God. Because God purposed your birthday. He brought you in the world for a purpose. Amen. When he said something up to happen to you, it's going to happen. Amen. It ain't to hurt you. It's to make you. It's to grow you. Job didn't understand he was an upright man, but Job had pride. Amen. Pride Amen. needed to die. Amen. Job know he was rich, man. He told him, I feed all y'all. I did all this. <laughs> I'm all in that. And a bag of chips. Yeah. I got all the candles. When you want a steak, you have to come buy one for me. <laughs> <laughs> come on, man. Party. Yeah, party. Come on. Now watch. Now watch what he say. I want you I want just read one to ten. Now I want you to jump down to 25, 26. Because it's a long, the whole story will tell you how Joe, really Joe's attitude was told God. Mm -hmm. See, some of us say we love God, but we have attitude. So true. If the pastor, somebody says something to you. Amen. Amen. You get a... Attitude. And when you try to tell yourself, you start trying to explain it and tell you no more than the pastor does. Uh -oh. Amen. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, help us. <laughs> and you look at him sometimes, pastor. One well, time, one would try to tell me I got so mad, I find myself. <laughs> I told her. 
You are our God ain't done nothing. That's right. That's you, That's God. Right. Amen. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> you don't blame God. That's right. Come on, y'all know y'all blame God. Amen. 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 Okay, I want you to read down to 1 through 10, chapter 3 of Job, and then we're going to get 25 and 26. The main one. I want y'all to see Job's attitude. Come on, Lynn. After this opened Job his mouth and cursed his day. He cursed his day. They said cursed his day. I believe mean, you were cursed. Yeah. <laughs> 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 no, no, y'all. Say y'all get mad, you cut. Amen. 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 No, 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 <laughs> a man hard good in mouth, but Amen. I Amen. 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 Now look what he said. And Job spake and said, Let the day perish wherein I was born, mm -hmm. and the night in which it was said, There is a man child conceived. Let that day be darkness. Let not God regard it from above, neither let the light shine upon it. Let darkness and the shadow of death stain it. Let a cloud dwell upon it. Let the blackness of the day terrify it. As for that night, let darkness seize upon it. Let it not be joined unto the days of the year. Let it not come into the number of the months. Lo, let that night be solitary. Let no joyful voice come therein. Let them curse it that curse the day who are ready to raise up their morning. Mm -hmm. Let the stars of the twilight thereof be dark. Let it look for light, but have none. Neither let it see the dawning of the day, mm -hmm. because it shut not up the doors of my mother's womb, nor hid sorrow from my eyes. Okay, I want you to start right there. What did Job do? He cursed God. He cursed his birthday. He, he spoke negative. Right. Ooh, yeah. He talked negative and they made Joe seem like Joe all that in the bag of chips. Mm. But Joe <laughs> spoke negative on his own situation. Yeah. Mm. 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 Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah. <laughs> 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 speak negative on ourselves. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. That's true. I ain't got to burn. <laughs> Lord, I just don't know what I'm going to do. Lord, what you say? <laughs> you say it's going to be weak. <laughs> <laughs> How? <laughs> Where? Come on. I don't know. <laughs> So I'm speaking negative. negative. Joe spoke negative on his own life. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep, that's right. That's right. Some of us, Woo. when you ain't come out of that, what you thought they come out of? Amen. You spoke negative on yourself. Amen. Come on. If I keep saying, pull me. How Yeah. 
That's why you need to get out of front of folks talking negative stuff. Right. I tell folks all the time, stop listening to that little fear. Right. Uh -huh. I'll show you, I'm going to get back on you. <laughs> back on you. When you pick your phone up, huh. you know what ear you go to first? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> This is just how you think about this. That's true. Your left ear is the negative. You hear all that negative stuff. Then you get tired of holding it on this side. You keep it on this side. <laughs> <laughs> and you know I said that ain't right. <laughs> you get tired. So when folks start telling you, don't turn your ear like this, <laughs> you better turn that ear like this so you hear this problems are negative. <laughs> My God. Right. I'm so I tell you, y'all need when you get to talking and negative stuff, don't say, uh, excuse me. I gotta go to the bathroom. Bell like mud here. So Job began to talk negative to his own destiny. Oh, hmm. That's right. Okay, I I I will I want y'all read right I'm gonna drop down and go to twenty-four. No, twenty-five and twenty-six. For the thing which I greatly feared is come upon me. Now see, the thing he greatly, it's that fear. He greatly feared. So if he greatly, greatly feared this, I need somebody. I need somebody to come to me. I'm gonna show you something. Y'all scared me, come to me. All right, now, now I knew she was coming. <laughs> <laughs> All right. He was greatly, great for fear. Okay. By him being like that, 